Special thanks to Warner Brothers for the free and early access to the LEGO Movie 2 video game. After finally making it to the Space Temple, we just needed to find a way to get in. Whatever evil schemes this queen was planning, we knew we had to stop them. Have you seen Batman? He's meant to be heading into the temple for the wedding ceremony. Batman, there you are. Oh, I've been told to help you reach the control room. Now the lift's stuck? That's the last thing we need. Don't suppose you know anything about powering up advanced space lifts? will take you right up to the temple control room. to stop the ceremony, I'm afraid you're too late. It's already begun. But if you can power up that fan lift and promise not to hurt me, I'll send you to the Queen's location. stop you, you know. In any case, step onto the fan lift to proceed.
I suppose I can't stop you. Just promise me you'll think about what you're doing before you disable that force field. General Mayhem sure had some advanced tech. Like, for example, using her tractor beam, we could lift super heavy objects with ease. Hold it there. So this is where it gets weird. All wrapped up, right? Defeated the villain? Saved the people? Wrong. Why don't you like us? We just wanted to play with you. The people were not happy. We soon realized that the queen wasn't evil after all. She just had a thing for Batman. I mean, don't get me wrong. That girl has some serious communication issues. But all she wanted was peace and harmony. And Batman. But she had absolutely no evil agenda. Turns out Rex was the bad guy. I know, right? All that machismo, please. Yeah. Rex was actually Emmett, but from an alternate universe. Like a version of Emmett that traveled down a different timeline. So in Rex's version, Emmett crashed into a giant asteroid and ended up stranded on the planet Undar of the Dryar system. That boy turned bitter. He was forgotten, lost, forced to watch others play without him, all that time festering away amongst the dirt. He spent weeks trying to get back on his feet, which, over time, he managed to do. In fact, he built a time machine and filled it with dinosaurs. Emmett changed his name to Rex and traveled back in time. His plan was to save his past self and turn Emmett into the kind of tough guy he wished he could have been. Well, lucky for you, I was around to save the day. I knew what I had to do. Rex's heart was just too bitter, too twisted. He just wouldn't let it go. Unfortunately for Rex, he kind of ceased to exist. Because Emmett stayed true to himself, the whole Rex thing could never have happened. Complicated, but something to do with a space-time continuum. So yeah, all good. The Queen just wanted us to come hang out and party. And who can blame her? For we are all truly awesome. Kit, love you. <laughs> <laughs>